welcome back in today's show we will learn about creating pop-ups in power apps so they are also called as model dialog so model dialog or pop-ups can be created in power apps by two methods the first is using the control grouping and the second method is using the content control so best way to create pop-ups or model dialog is using content control so let's see how we can create pop-ups in our existing screen which is income so here in income screen we want when user clicks on this delete icon one pop-up window should open that will ask the confirmation for deletion so how can we create that so let me have one variable over here set where show delete pop-up okay so i'll make it as true i'll copy that so i'll add one container over here as we discussed we will create pop-up using containers i'll place it over the application okay to have a blur effect go to its fill property so let's change this to 169 169 169 here i'll write 0.75 okay so that we can have blur effect so within this container i'll add one more containers for that i'll choose this container and insert container so it will add container within this container stretch it to center change this back color to white so that it has clearly visible well go it from here all right so i'll choose this container let me add one rectangle change its fill color the app color stored dark color so add one label insert text label okay so change this to 10 we'll make it bold and text property i'll ask are you sure you want to delete this record let me change its color to our theme color see app colors dot dark color right so let's move a little down this container control visible property so we have to set if this where this variable is equal to true then it should be visible else it should be it should be false i think we can remove that so let's copy this from here i'll run it click on delete icon you got the pop-up okay so here i'll select this container control and paste those controls all right so let's rename that okay to change this to okay okay so also let me remove that code on the on select property So here um, we will write set where show delete pop up make it false. So here we will write delete functionality. So once we able to perform the delete functionality, so we will hide this pop up. All right. So let me copy the same code. The cancel as well. 
all right so here user can hide this dialog box while clicking on cancel let's try that click on cancel pop-up has gone click on delete pop-up is there we have a proper blur effect all right so this way uh, we can create the pop-up so we can add any controls over here in this pop-up so the best way is to create the pop-up using the container controls thank you